Hello everyone and welcome back here to Minecraft on the Tuxedo server. I am out here by my little cottage in the uh, sea, working on my uh, my little palace under the sea. I don't know what to call it yet. Um, the agreed on name so far has been Galantis, which seems to be right. And you know, clearing out this area, I decided I needed to tidy this place up as well. I need to uh, I need a, a bit of a utilitarian area to work on some stuff. So I've got the portal there on the top of a nice sand plinth. And while cleaning it out, I notice this down here. I put the door in, but looks like there's going to be a whole lot of exploring going on down here. Hello, Mr. Skeleton. Can't be bothered with you, Mr. Skeleton. Goodbye, Mr. Skeleton. Oh, that's very rude of you. But you can't do that. But apparently not. Can I? There we go. Right. So... So I've cleared this area out here a bit and I'm thinking of putting a field in and um, I've got some eggs so the inevitable chickens will follow. In fact let's do a little bit of that quickly here. Let's get um, there's my hoe. So if we have this area here like this as in fact, let's go in one from there. Uh, we only really need one. I think we're only going to need one watering hole here, so that'll be there. That's good. Okay, uh, so let's get a bucket of water in there. Oh, where's my bucket? Uh, been putting things in and out of my inventory so much that I've probably misplaced it somewhere. Uh, yeah, no bucket there, and no bucket there. I'm going to have to make any one, which means I shall find it almost immediately afterwards, because that seems to be the way it goes. So there we go, bucket. Let's get us some water. There's no such thing as salt water in this world, so I'll just take it from the sea there. Chuck that in, and that will irrigate this, so let's get this area just quickly hold like that and I've got some potatoes and carrots so let's get a few of those in 4, 8, 12, 24, 25, 27 Looks like we're having 11 potatoes and we'll make the rest up in carrots. Not exactly the ideal, I'd rather have more potatoes than carrots, but I don't have more potatoes than carrots. But as the potatoes go, I can replace the, the carrots, that's easy enough. There we go, and we'll do carrots over this side. And that should help keep me uh, fed. And I suppose we could do a little chicken coop over here, couldn't we? In fact, why don't we do this now? As we're just getting stuff organised, why don't we do this now? Somebody asked me the other day why I called a chicken a chicken and I didn't call it a gullen because there, well, there's a vast difference between a chicken and a gullen. These are chickens, okay? You know, chickens, they, they, they mill around, they eat grass, they eat hay, they don't, they... Sorry, don't need you. Uh, they, they lead a fairly harmless life, they don't bother anyone. All's good with the world. 
and you know, eventually they get turned into food. That's that's a chicken. A gullen, a gullen is it's a difference in attitude, to be totally honest with you. A gullen is the sort of creature who, if they wander into your house and see a cauldron, will sit in the cauldron and then look at you belligerently as if to say, why are you looking surprised at the fact I've sat in a cauldron? But isn't surely, isn't that exactly what one does with a cauldron? I mean, are you mad? Oh, there we go. That's the difference between a gullen and a chicken. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the gullen bite. Okay. So the f right. So what I've got. I want is furnaces. I've got six already. I want to make another six. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and. My design a idea here. I don't know if this is going to work. It's going to call for some smooth stone. So actually, it's going to call for stone bricks. But to start them going, you need smooth stone. And I'm going to build a little smeltery area here. So the first thing I really need to do is have a good idea of where I want to build. So one, two, three. Quiznuts, formerly known as Throut002, joined the game. And he's probably going to say nasty things now to me, based upon what I did to him the other day. Completely innocently, I don't know why. I mean, it's... I invented the doggy tank. Two, four, six, twelve. All right, let's start with twelve. I've got, actually, I've got another four, so that's probably going to be good enough. Okay, I want to do a... <laughs> ah, cat's off at this point. Revenge! She is mine. Say hello to my YouTube follower. Follow... Uh, there we go. It'd be useful if I learned how to spell one day. So, okay, right. We will have... Hmm, how should we do this? Oh, actually, I'll tell you what. Let's get rid of these. Let's just try something out here. No? Hello. Let's put them back. <laughs> and I shall avenge myself of your revenge. Then we may have to join up to fight off mod and Meritai. Uh, yes, um, in this, in the last Euro Truck Simulator video, Mod was saying he was going to get Muratai to, well basically he was going to get Muratai to beat us up while he hid behind her skirts. I think that's, I think that's, that's a perfectly way, a fair way of describing the way he said that. Alright, so yeah, so we'll have a bit of a, a bit of definition to the chimneys here. That's, that's only going to be visible from outside, but I think that's going to be perfectly fine. And...
Oh, that's fun. Right. Okay, let's get these down. I've got these in the back. Yeah, I like those. So think of one little touch for that that I don't have. Oh, why do I have the materials? Let's just check. If I don't, well, I won't say what it is, but I'll go and hunt for some stuff. Oh, we've got some carrots growing already. Excellent. Uh, okay. Check through me chests. Yeah. No, I'm not seeing any. Oh, I won't say what I was going to do, but I will go and hunt for the materials I need, and I'll show you guys later on. Okay, so we got the sides of this building and the back of this building done. Now what we need to do is the front of this building. And I need a little bit of sand, I think. So let's go and grab some here. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 10, 11, 12. That's all I need. You can imagine I'm probably going to get the rest or, uh, later on anyway, but uh, let's just take what I need for now. And which furnace was I using before? Uh, it doesn't matter because I let's just stick the coal in there. And. Stick some sand in there, let's make some glass out of that. So I want some mixture here of sandstone and some nice big doors. I think the doors are going to be too wide and too wide and the pillar and then we'll have sandstone like this. Okay, need more sandstone. Need more everything. Oh, gosh. Okay, where's that? There we go. Right. That keeps going. So, one pillar there. So. There we go. And we'll do the same over this side. So, that's three wide. So that's three wide. Two, three. One, two, three. Okay, and. Mm, one there. One there. Uh, let's go back to snow bricks. And I want to make. Pillars either side. Welcome back. Okay, we'll do the same here. Okay, oh, one, two, three, four. Is there any stone? Nope, I was cooking up some, so perhaps I got some in the house. Give it the time, we might. Oh, oh, actually, there's another person on the server now. It won't work. There we go. That's the stone I'm looking for. So. It's four stone bricks. So we'll have them. Like that. Okay, now what I'm imagining here, okay, is I want a massive set of oak doors here. Alright. But this is a furnace, and I just can't see people wanting to sit in the furnace all day with heat drenching off them and these massive doors shut. So I'm just going to build the doors open. Okay, and I think the effect is going to be nice. If not, I'll probably be recording this again and you would never know this happened. Uh, I swear I had some fence... Fences... I don't believe I used them all up. I do! I do have some fences! 
You're a man of means, Simon. You have fences. Let's just block this office. It's getting dark. That way I only really have to worry about skeletons shooting at me. Oh. Okay, and... Actually... Oh, it's not one, not. There we go. Right, okay, so we should have the glass by now. Uh, excellent. Okay, so let's go make some window panes. And I did indeed make too much, but... Oh dear lord, I use glass so much. So I have some nice big windows at the front there. Let's put some temporary lighting up. Temporary because I have an idea how to light this place and it's going to look great, I think. But, uh... Oh, no, my OCD doesn't like that. Let's put it there. There we go. Right, okay. So, we're going to have these massive doors and I think... What does Dark Oak look like here? Let's compare that to spruce. Mm, I think my money is on dark oak. So, okay, so basically, what I want now is some dark oak wood. We have, ladies and gentlemen, our first egg. And it was a dud. Let's get some, okay, so let's get some wood. Okay, and these doors are gonna be like this, thrown open. Yeah, they cover up the window a little bit, but I don't think that's particularly a bad thing. Like that. And two, three, four, five. Hmm. Hmm. Hinges. Hinges. Block of iron. Hinges. Words. Ladies and gentlemen, we have our second egg. These guys are nothing if not productive. The eggs, however, not that good. Okay, I don't know what this is going to look like, but let's try it. And there. So that where we want... Okay, and the same. Uh, we'll do the same here. Okay, and we'll put some blocks of iron there. What does that look like? That looks a bit weird, to be totally honest with you. Hmm. Okay, and it looks like. glass doesn't quite work anyway so let's make that smaller I've got an idea here Oop. okay running out of space here let's make ourselves a chest and let's start putting some things into the chest. Alright, uh, we don't need that iron. Don't need those blocks of iron. Don't need that sandstone. There we go. Okay, so let's change some things here. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. And 
Oh yes, that, that might work nicely. Okay, let's try that. So, get rid of this wood. Okay, so the uh, wall's actually going to go like this. Let's make a bit more. So let it go like that, and let's strip off this side as well. Okay, like that. Oh wait, thank you. All right. And okay, and the doors will go doink 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 and doink. Okay, and so we need to strip away some of this wood. Like that. And we need to get the top one. Okay, so we're going to create a bit of texture to these, like that, and like that. So we do the same over here. Like that. Oh, it missed. Okay, and not spruce, dark oak. So we got these two massive doors flung open. Yeah, that's not too bad, I think, actually. That's not too bad at all. I quite like that. Um, we're going to need to change the fence because it's warping and we're going to need to get rid of this glass because it's not working But I think we can get around that by actually putting glass blocks in there Okay, do I have any glass blocks? Did I convert the whole thing to panes? I did. It's gonna get some more glass. Uh, get some more sand, shall we? Leave that open for a sec. Okay, so what do we not need? Don't need that anymore. Don't think I'm gonna need that anymore. Don't need that anymore. Don't need that anymore. Okay. Uh, sand is over here. Yeah, that's good. Uh, One eight. There we go. Oh, the tape is growing. We are, I would appear, self-sufficient. Okay, so let's just pop that in the furnace. We'll come back and get the glass in a little bit. So we just fill these areas with blocks. Because, you know, you're going to want windows here when the doors are closed, I think. And that's, that's going to look all right. So, yeah, okay, right, so let's take that one out, let's take that one out, and we're going to want like that, like that, like that, like that, that there, and we just run out, make some more. Yeah, I know I don't really need to put one in this hole, but I like to. Okay, so we'll get like that, and we're going to need to clear out a little bit of space in here. And let's go and get the magic ingredient. There's going to be no worries about lighting this area up at all. Because we're going to put a pigging great fire in the middle of it. Idea being... Yeah, you know, this is going to be an area where we get a forge. This is our forgery. This is our glass works. So you know, this is our work is going to happen. 
Greetings. Okay, so you know, nice big flame. Nice big fire in the roof. Well, there you go. I don't really feel the need to do anything else to that. I think I quite like the look of that. I've uh, tidied it up a little bit, and I've re I've s replaced the floor with all sandstone. Are you can come round and say hello. You are, aren't you? Knockback swords, and the doors kind of frame the whole area quite nicely, and they they still actually look a little bit like doors. Um, even though I couldn't work out how to do with some hinges, I'm gonna put some handles on them actually. That's not a bad idea. I'll, I'll do that and perhaps we'll see it in the next episode. But there we go. We're now self sufficient, more or less. We have um, crops, we have zombies, we have chickens, we have our crafting area. I've moved the ambles out here. I think they look quite nice there. And we only caught fire once, which, to be honest with you, if you only caught fire once, then you know, you're doing a not bad job when you're playing with fire. But that's all part of the fun. Just keep your head and think about where you went wrong. In your case, it was coming to say hello. So there we go. Alright, so I think we'll leave it there. I've been Simon Parsons. This has been Minecraft Arcadia. Thank you and good night.